wanna know is secret. Hey, what is up guys? Grenader here. Welcome to another video and today really quickly I'm going to show you guys how to use After Effects in five minutes. So uh, first things first, open up After Effects. You can simply do that by clicking on the logo and it should load up. Now once it's loaded up, I'm going to show you guys how to import and just do kind of the basic stuff that you need to know in order to navigate through um, After Effects. So uh, let's start by creating a new project so in order to create a new project you click this button right here and it will pop up with another window and this window is the window that will let you adjust the settings that you need so uh, right here you can adjust the resolution um, the frame rate and um, the time so the start time code basically means when um, the video starts so it's gonna start at zero right and then right here is a duration or basically when it ends so I guess 30 seconds is alright um, hit OK and all that and then what you want to do after that you make your composition you make your project and this is what you're greeted with and it looks pretty overwhelming but um, what you could do to sort of make it easier to look at you could turn off or um, exit out of these windows that you don't need exit out of the presets and keep the preview the preview is pretty helpful because you can um, RAM preview stuff and change the resolution and whatnot so uh, let's go to file or not file is it yeah file import and then import file and then you just look for something to import so I'm just going to import some quick gameplay here um, some Assassin's Creed gameplay and there you go this is error. I don't know what that means. Okay, guys, so really quick, I'm going to show you guys what I did here. So I had, I just ran into this problem, never have ever run into anything like this in my career. And so um, it said something about overflow. And so I Googled the, or right here it says After Effects error overflow converting, blah, blah, blah. So when you get an error, just copy and paste what it says into um, Google and it should you know come up with some videos and then um, oops it came up with this video right here that I clicked on right here and it just basically showed me how to fix it and so that is something that I want to teach you guys as well is how to troubleshoot your problems without you know having to call your supervisor or having to call somebody and let me just meet my phone real quick and so yeah I fixed it as you can see the gameplay and everything is working out so in this case, if this ever happens to you, just right click, go to intercept footage or interpret, and then you click on conform. So if you use the frame rate, uh, use frame rate from file, um, it won't work. But if you click um, conform to frame rate, then it does that. So I'm going to hit OK. So you can see there's some gameplay. And again, we only got 30 seconds of it because we don't need much, right? So um, let's start by just learning how to cut stuff yeah there's nothing there's not a usually you right click and there's something that says split or cut but in this case you have to do it the old-fashioned way which is hitting control shift and D and by hitting that combination sim simultaneously that's a big word simultaneously um, it will allow you to make a cut into the video you can click on stuff and delete it and then you can also um, just drag by using your mouse you just drag the video and you can cut like that but again the combination of control shift D is much more precise then you can move stuff like that um, if you ever need to zoom into something so let's say you're working on an audio strip you hit LL and it should show you the audio stuff and you can simply just increase these little mountains or I think they look like mountains but they're just triangles so the closer um, you can get to it um, the frame, like you can see here frame by frame what it looks like and then you know you just zoom out and whatnot um, also really quick last thing I want to show you guys because I don't want this video to be too long I want to keep this short and concise so that way you learn a couple of things at a time versus just showering your brain with a bunch of knowledge and so at this point we already um, associated how to cut and the audio stuff um, let me show you guys how to add motion blur in this case motion blur blur motion blur won't really do anything because it's gameplay it's not gonna work uh, but let's say you do um, a transition so really quick 
uh, I animate this to go away or something. So let's see, like right here, like that. Make it go away like that. As you can see, there's motion blur as it moves. But if I take that off, there's no motion blur and it's very choppy. So motion blur, very, very helpful. You have to enable it um, overall and then enable um, specific clips. So there you go. All right, guys, that is it. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the five minute tutorials and it's fast, concise, and you learn a lot. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.